Now let's try this problem. The integers 34041 and 32506 when divided by a three digit integer n leave the same remainder. What is the value of n? Uh, before we do this problem, I just take some smaller examples uh, so you will be able to understand the concept which we are going to use over here. Okay, uh, friends, I won't be discussing much, much algebra of it. Uh, for that, you can definitely browse my uh, number system sessions because uh, if at all I start explaining the algebra behind it, it will be taking a lot of time. Okay, so suppose I take two integers, uh, maybe 11 and 15. Okay, the same problem I'm solving over here. The integers 11 and 15 when divided by an integer leave the same remainder. What is the, an integer maybe suppose x, leave the same remainder. What I'm doing over here is instead of 34041, I'm taking 11 and instead of 32506, I'm taking 15. So definitely the problem is uh, becomes simple and we can understand the concept, okay. Now 11 and 15, if they are divided by an integer x, they leave the same remainder. What is x? That means what is that integer, okay. Now, what I do is I just find the difference between these two. That is 15 minus 11. It's 4. Now, 4 and any factor of 4, if we divide 11 and 15 by 4 or its factor, we will be getting the same remainder. Just try. If 11 is divided by 4, we'll be getting the remainder as 3. If 15 is divided by 4, we'll be getting the remainder as 3. If we use the factor of 4, that is 2. If 11 is divided by 2, we'll be getting the remainder as 1. And 15 is divided by 2, we'll be getting the remainder as 1. Okay, now let's take one more example uh, to elaborate it. Suppose I have 13 and 19. Now 13 and 19, when divided by an integer y, leave the same remainder. Further, if you divide 13 and 19 by that difference, you'll be getting the same remainder. Okay, this is very simple division concept no very big algebra I am using over here. So to generalize this, uh, I am sorry, in this case 13 if it is divided by 6, the remainder is 1. 19 if it is divided by 6, the remainder is 1. Okay, and how did we get uh, 6? It is 13 and 19's difference. The same concept will apply over here. We find out the difference of 3, 2, 5, 0, 6 and 3, 4, 0, 4, 1. Okay. So it is 15.35, but we don't have 15.35 uh, over here in options. So let's see if any number is factor of 15.35. So I can just see 307. If I multiply it by 5, I'll be getting 15.35. So 307 will be the correct option since it is factor of 15.35. Okay, so a very simple concept is there, which I tried uh, to explain by taking smaller examples. You can choose more examples also, maybe 17 and 25. If you find uh, like uh, what is a number, if 17 and 25 are divided, will get the same, will give the same remainder. That is the difference of these two. By 8, by 8, you'll be getting the same remainder as 1 and 1. Okay, the same funda we have used over here. I hope you are clear.